Hello, welcome to my Louis vlog. Holy shit. <laughs> so I woke up from a nightmare only to find out that it's literally 2.30 in the morning and people are already showing up to the venue for camping. Um, it's two days before the concert or like a day and a half anyways. So I am now scrambling my little ass off, getting my stuff together and we're gonna fucking head down there. Hello, good morning and welcome to the fucking Louis show. <laughs> Okay, so this is what we're working with. Hello, Stevie. My tent and like chair and stuff is downstairs, but it's now 3.50 a.m. So I can, I'm kind of like pacing right now because I have like 10 minutes to kill or like 20 and I just don't know what to fill my time with. So I literally just walk here in my room like this. Um, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put myself in my car and then I'm gonna stop at McDonald's, get myself a coffee because Starbucks isn't fucking open. Yeah, oh my god guys, I literally like, don't know what the fuck to do right now, like it is, I'm... <laughs> but I'm getting like all my stuff together, oh my god. Okay, okay, I'll update you in, I have more to say. Thank you for your visit, but we are currently closed. What? Please visit us again during our normal business hours. McDonald's isn't 24 hours anymore? Oh, what the fuck, what the fuck guys? What? Oh my god. Okay, well, off to Waterburger now. Man, there's an auto Waterburger in the opposite direction I just came. Motherfucker! Okay, change of plans. Let me find the nearest fucking Waterburger. Oh my god. Okay, it's time for part two. Made it to a Waterburger. Please be open. Welcome to Waterburger. How may I help you? Hi, can I get a large black coffee with cream and sugar? Anything I go to you? Um, a biscuit with honey butter. No chicken. Okay, anything else I can get for you? And uh, hash browns. That'd be five fifty at the second one, though. Thank you. No problem. Look, yes. Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Unfortunately. <laughs> Four forty-nine a.m. I dropped my camera, so I'm sure it's like really fucked now. You Darby's being a good student. <laughs> it's Twenty-eight hundred followers. Exactly. How perfect. Oh my god. 28 is infested in my brain. The time is now 6.17. Got a pumpkin spice latte. No one else has showed up though. So, still just, still just us. The sun is starting to rise. Everyone is starting to wake up. Are you, are you cold? Get our signs up. Look at this visor. Isn't this the best visor you've ever seen in your entire life? So Sweet little Harry. We're all like watching this guy change the sign and we all like woke up from our slumber and now we're all just standing here waiting for the sign. <laughs> the L's up. The L's up. Go for it. Oh my god. This is the most exciting part of our day. <laughs> we're it's like Jeff, we're like, what's the what's like the, 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 the letter board game? We're like, uh, can I get a tea? Do we have any teas? Do we have any teas? Do you know what I'm talking about? Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> yeah. Wheel of Fortune, yeah. Can I do an M? We got an M on the board. What about an L? There it is. <laughs> hey! Woo! Yes! This is so exciting. Oh my god. Everyone's just standing, watching him change the sign. <laughs> In exactly 24 hours, we will be getting wristbands. Okay, here we go. Three, two, go. Woo! You got it. You got it. You got it. Drink. Oh, mine's fucking backwards. Go, go. My tab was upside down. Open your throat and take it. Is this what hazing's like? Yeah. My dad just brought me KFC and I'm gonna try their new Beyond Chicken. So yeah, that's just what this is. This is this is the content you guys are signing up for. We're gonna try it with some honey mustard. Who needs a wristband? Wristband! I'm excited. Mmm. Mmm. Thumbs was a little tough, but it's good. Yeah, I feel good. Yeah. Good for chicken that's not chicken. Good for chicken that's not chicken. Where's the dial? Oh my god! Oh my god! The one. What is it? 
Sweet family. Oh my god. <laughs> this is just becoming a Gabby vlog at this point. True icon. We're playing Wait, One Gabby? Direction Cards Against Humanity, and this was the first card we pulled. Right like the no first idea. one. <laughs> Louis, our judge. Should I be at the bath? We're on a venture to, to the hotel to go pee. Kaylee just got here. It's with an alley. Hey, Look at this hotel, guys. Oh my god, who is she? Hey, girl. <laughs> Dude, they're handing out pizza to everybody. It's like in fucking moving boxes, though, right there. So it's like, okay, I've never seen that, but that's so nice. Oh my god. The sign is back up and the sun's going down. When the sun goes down. <laughs> Got the pizza. That's all. Okay. Family dinner. They're so nice to each other. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Euphoria at the fucking Louis show. <laughs> Doing sound checks, so we're all running. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. This is the most exercise I've done in such a long time. Only for Louie. How, how long have you been working? Oh my god. No fucking way, it's through the dark. Oh my god. whole cookie cake oh sweet icons like let's just take a moment oh my god gorgeous gorgeous girl lily my louisiana icon brought a whole fucking king cake straight from the boot we finna dive in it's gonna be good rio is playing the baby of the show habit teaching them young starting them young <laughs> Hi, Lou! Okay, <laughs> it's like nothing. <laughs> he is in there. That's all that matters is that he's in there. Bye, Louie. See you tomorrow. Bye. You're so golden. Da -da -da -da. something wrong and it hits me when the lights come on shit maybe i miss you <laughs> For the first time ever, I think I'm gonna try and go to sleep. 
How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Emotionally wounded. Guys, it's the fucking trenches out here. <laughs> this is rough as fuck. <laughs> okay, I looked at you if I just close my eyes or if I stare at the ceiling. The ceiling being the sky. <laughs> okay? Anyways, the earth ceiling. The earth ceiling. <laughs> okay. Here's just a little line update. I don't know how far you can see, but it's like all the way down there. And we got like all these people. Here's like our little stash, more of our group. And then there's the front, literally right here. Yeah. Also, I didn't sleep at all. So I'm about to go and get some nachos from 7-Eleven. Also, there's a little Harry one for his birthday. Isn't that so sweet? Oh, what an amazing group of people. Love these humans so very much. Kayla and Rio, fucking icons. Okay, besties, I'm gonna show you how I make my nachos at 7-Eleven. So you get your nachos, right? Open it up. And then, save your bag. And you just wanna do like an even bottom layer so you still have chips in here. And then go ahead and get a plate of cheese going. So you got like a nice little layer, first layer of cheese, yes. And then you're gonna take the rest of your chips. Make an absolute fucking mess everywhere of crumbs. That's key. And then you're just gonna cheese it up. Just get it on in there. Go ahead and like shake them a little bit. And there you have it. 7-Eleven nachos, dinner fucking champions. Bon appetit, bitch. So I've walked into 7-Eleven like 80 times and I've been staring at this rose. And I think this is the rose I'm gonna throw on stage and give to Louie. We're making this happen. Okay. Coming back to camp with my rose and nachos. Okay. Everybody's sleeping. <laughs> it's two in the morning, haven't slept. I got a tent and it just goes like way back there. This is the first time Lily slept and she's got like a little snore going on. <laughs> it's very cute. Well guys, for the first time all day, ever since we got here, me and Lily are taking a nice little excursion to Dunkin' Donuts. We're so excited to finally leave our spot and head into the real world. So, yeah. You guys, we're at the airport. Um, I don't know how this happened, but it took us to the airport. I just want to go home. <laughs> Oh my god. Head northwest on Herb Kelleher Way. <laughs> it was Herb Kelleher. In a quarter mile, slight left yeah, onto Contrail it's Lane. It's fucking in the <laughs> It's in the actual, like, how did I leave? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Goodbye, Love Field. I don't know how we ended up here. But now we're going to a Starbucks. Okay. Miraculously, we made it back. I don't know why I just sort of slurped it that way. Okay, whatever. So it's about like two hours till wristbands and a bunch of fans just came because they think that they can like scam our line and So we like, you know had security come and like push them off property and now the cops are here and everything And I literally got in a fight with them like they weren't moving So I went across the street and it was like um like I haven't slept in 30 hours. I haven't showered I haven't brushed my teeth. You're not gonna fucking do that like not gonna do that so I'll keep you guys updated on the situation at hand but it's about to be fight night. I'm not even fucking, like, I'm not even kidding. Literally have, like, the cops here with us. Oh, no, you're good. <laughs> Just vlogging. <laughs> so, and then we, like, oh, there was a cop in here, but he's left. But it's that line right there. They're, like, trying to make their own little line, which, that's not fucking happening. <laughs> Update, guys. It's... 9.56. 9.56. We have been told that they're not doing wristbands at 10 because it's a fucking shit show. There's four lines going on right now. Oh no, three. They condensed. But there are three. Yeah, there are three. And it, it's just it's just really bad. Cops are here the whole night. Nothing's gotten better since the last update. It's gotten kind of worse. We're hopeful. We're hopeful. We we're told that, you know, Live Nation is in our favor. And like literally Live Nation is here to deal with this absolute bullshittery. So uh, we'll keep you updated. I mean if they want to see my vlog footage of what we've been through, I will show them it. There's evidence. Y'all wanna see the ground we've been sleeping on? Y'all wanna see the ground we've been sleeping on? There's dog shit. There's like literally dog shit right over here. Like 
it's it's hell out here, okay? <laughs> yeah. Who put the dookie there? Who put the dookie there? Who pooped? So, I mean, I continue to keep you updated, but nothing's updated so far. Cute, cheeky update, guys. Uh, they just bum rushed. So, literally everyone that's like was in the front, like, look, there they go. Yeah, so. Didn't get wristbands, but we're gonna go to the back of the fucking club, get drunk as fuck, Fox and South dance fuck south side. So, it's still gonna be a really fun time. Yeah, so we're gonna have the best time ever, yeah. all together. But Lisa Louis, baby. Honestly, yes. camping was still a lot of fun. I don't regret it at all. I had an amazing time, and I'm so happy I did this. Like. You know, um, it's one thing to be close to your faves, but just genuinely camping with these people was such a phenomenal experience. And I, I literally texted my mom and I was like, you know, I don't know if I'll ever do this again. Just genuinely, you know, I don't know if I'll camp. Um, not because it was like, you know, hard and stuff. It was, it was really hard. But I was like, you know, I'm so I'm just soaking this in. So just know guys, like, They're it's cheering. okay. Why are we cheering? So. I think that. So they haven't given us wristbands, so like you have time. They're putting us all in like our number order, okay? As you saw, they were literally lining us up, and now we're just all sitting here, and standing, because they stopped doing that for some reason, and now no one has any idea what the hell's happening. So I'm just sitting by myself on this little bench, because I'm about to have a fucking panic attack. But once again, point still stands. If I don't get the wristband, what the fuck ever. It's just literally so insane right now, so. 
Keep you fucking updated. So we've started to do a snake, so it's like curving around here in the front, and now we're yelling at everybody trying to get them in line. We're doing it our fucking selves because Southside refuses to help us, so we're literally doing it ourselves because what the fuck is this? So, keep you updated some more. I'm running this shit, bitch. I'm fucking running this shit. Also, I peed a little when I just yelled. Don't tell anyone, though. <laughs> hey, guys. Just a little update. As you can tell, I am home. Um, I probably won't be giving, like, a full in-depth thing of what's happening right now. I don't even, like, remember driving home that well. I need to take a shower. I also just started my period. I literally just started my... Like, ugh. Once I explain everything that happened, the fact that I just had my period is the cherry on top of this shit. But I'll go more into depth. I just am not myself right now. Yeah, um, I'm gonna go take a shower. Okay. See you in a second with an update. I just got a shower. Oh my fucking god, I feel reborn. But it is so cold in here. Hang on, I don't want you guys to see me get naked, so one second. So, basically, you know, what you saw, it was a bombard and everything, and it was just, guys, it was just such a shit show. No one knew what was happening. No one that worked there knew what was happening. Even after I left, like, there was still so many, like, up-in-the-air type things, and it was just, God, it was just so horrible, and I'm bipolar, so when I don't get to sleep, or eat that well and I'm facing dehydration. Like, I don't know if you guys saw my lips during this fucking vlog. They were crusted and like so red the entire time of this. And so exhaustion, dehydration, like overstimulation. Oh my fucking God, you like, guys, I almost had like 20 panic attacks. It was so bad. And I just like, you know, had to make the executive decision to head on out, you know, once things kind of happened and they said that you know the first round of we're not doing wristbands anymore i was just like you know what i can't fucking do this anymore and you know am i sad that i won't be able to like see louis fucking nostrils i mean yeah duh you know i feel like anyone would want to like be barricaded and be up close for their faves but genuinely that was one of the funnest experiences i've ever done minus the shit show okay that wasn't that fun but they but just like the actual camping part like you guys i just like had i mean i'm sure you can fucking tell like i had such a fun time and i'm i'm so happy that i did it and i don't regret it one bit like i love my friends so fucking much they are the coolest people ever and I had never felt so loved and accepted in my entire life. Like, I just felt at peace and at home, even though I was sleeping on dog shit and cigarette butts in the streets of Dallas. I feel like I'm coming undone and get a little crazy. But I just, I don't know. I don't regret it one bit. <sighs> Literally started my period. The shit show happened and I'm out of my fucking moisturizer. I can't take this, you guys. I can't fuck. Oh my god. And like I have to upload some footage because I need like the memory space. My camera battery's about to die. I don't know where my extra one is. I have to be back up there at like 4.30. It's 1.05. I haven't slept. I need to sleep. Like it's just oh my god, you guys. I don't know I don't I don't I don't know what's going on right now. You know, to the people that are really kind of upset that we camped and stuff, I mean this happens at every single show, so I don't understand why it was, like, such a shock. I mean, it's a small venue for Louis goddamn Tomlinson. Like, anytime someone would drive by, they'd be like, Louis Tomlinson, and they'd be like, yeah, One Direction, and they'd be like, oh my god, everyone did that. Like, it was the smallest venue for the world's largest, cutest, sweetest puppy, baby boy, I want to just hold you close, Louis Tomlinson. And truly, like, the fucking venue just dropped the goddamn ball. I want to reiterate that this was above any fan's hands. This was above any of our hands. When people started bum-rushing, all of the people... I'm going to... All of the majority of the people that were, like, 25... Because I was 23. 
that were 25 and up, we stood there and we were like, I can't believe this is happening. Like we didn't follow through with the bum rush. The entire time we were in our little huddle being like, we're gonna stay calm, we're not gonna panic, we're not gonna cross lines, we're not gonna cause hysteria. Like we are just gonna like do our thing that we've been doing. Stevie, I know, right? Oh, she's going off. So, you know, this was way above any fucking fan's hands. And I need y'all to know that. We had no clue what was happening the entire time. None of us knew. And you know, I'm, I'm just happy that I did it. And I had a lot of fun. And I love Louie to the ends of the fucking earth. And you know, my, some of my friends are still up there and they're holding, on, holding down the fort and going strong. And fucking salute to you because I, I just couldn't. I literally could not do it anymore, guys. And I'm, I'm sorry. I'm still gonna like film the show and stuff, so like keep watching. This was just an explanation of what the fuck happened. I there's no words to describe what went down, and I I mean like I wish I could have filmed more for you guys, but during the time, I was on the verge of you know literally panic attacks. I couldn't breathe. I had to like rip my turtleneck off, and I'm sure I like flashed people because I wasn't wearing a bra, and it was just like nothing that i could have ever expected this is my first time camping you know like i don't know what the fuck i'm doing <sighs> i'm not mad i'm just disappointed and i don't blame louis oh my god not one bit that man had no idea what was happening i mean i'm sure he had an idea but like what is he gonna do come out there and direct the line himself that would be a horrible decision Southside, you really fucking dropped the ball you needed to understand that this is louis goddamn tomlinson like this is so I'm gonna try and get like 30 minutes to an hour's worth of sleep and hope that that does fucking something because I don't feel like a real human being right now. I feel like a fucking Mario character. Like I feel like I'm in a goddamn video game and it's just not fun. So I will update you when I have something more. It's a Davy bug, but I have something more to say. Yeah, guys, that was just beyond words. Yeah, I know, right, girly pop? Oh my God. Well, I really did try and wake up at like, you know, two or something. It's four o'clock. My dad just came in here and was like, knock, knock, Jillibane, are you okay? And I was like, what? what the fuck is happening? So, currently shoving all my shit into a bag because I'm now gonna go and like get ready with my friends. Dude, I was like gonna get ready here. I was gonna go live on TikTok for a bit. Like, all out the window, all out the window. Okay, I'm gonna pack my bag. And yeah, holy fuck guys, this is like, oh my god. All right, it's literally five o'clock and I just made it back to Dallas. Well, back to Southside. I'm about to go meet up with my friends in their hotel room. Get ready super fucking fast. Dude, this is like the most, oh my god. I'm gonna go buy a large Red Bull from the gas station first though because I will not survive. I will not survive. I did not realize I was this fucking sunburnt. Like this is so bad. Anyways, made it to the hotel. We got the makeup on the counter. It's time to fucking party. Let's get it going. Lily made me a drink. I'm about to just turn up the fuck up and call it a goddamn day. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Alright. Okay. Ready? Here's the Here's the us. Whatever, whatever. Let's get up. <laughs> oh, I can use a plane, just a little taste, baby. Not bad, but like you don't want to go. Yeah, yeah I, just wanna, I just want to put out. Hey, listen, I made that toast up. I made it up on the spot. I'm so proud of her. Do you want another one? Litter me up, baby. Oh, yeah. Incredible. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
bisexual. I'm a queer. My fellow bisexual. Wait, 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 the lights off, it's not our time. I'll know our time. We'll know our time. We'll know our time. It's gonna be kids. doing a Louis song. It's gonna be yeah. It's not romantic, it's gonna be what it's doing. It's gonna be doing Louis Habit. <laughs> I've heard it sounds like Habit today that I just made the video. Me and Brianna are gonna kiss during Habit, y'all just watch out. Oh! It's me and Jillian kiss during Habit. Oh! We're getting, we're getting married. Oh, Did that just we're go going. down the thing? Let's go! Yes, 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 Wait, do we have any more? I'm crying. If me and Jillian kiss during Habit, we're getting married and everyone's invited to the wedding. Okay. Perfect. Sounds good. <laughs> Okay. And Everyone now say hi. 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 Alright, I'll keep my music actually. <laughs> <laughs> smile, 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 smile. I almost just fucking fell. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we fucking made it after the trials and tribulations of today. Yeah, we made it. We underestimated. Finally. Now we're saying goodbye. Oh my god. Someone tell me to shut up. Fuck. <laughs> this shit blurry as fuck. I don't know. <laughs> this line, this line is like astronomical. Like it's genuinely. I was shut my phone. It's genuinely crazy. I feel on the good side. It's 6:41. We're gonna see how long this takes, but it's really. We're on the fucking highway right now. Like it is insane. You wanna say hi? Hi. <laughs> Honestly, you're like the star of this vlog really? at this point. Yeah. I'm gonna be famous! Yeah, you know. Whoever decided to give me two you shots, totally aka yeah. Kaylee, what the fuck is wrong? Cheers! Cheers! Oh my god, you don't worry. I mean, we're in Lebanon. I mean, we're in Lebanon. Oh. Uh. Bigger merch site, we're gonna go and look, but and the this is what the merch is looking like. I'm gonna get that white shirt and that poster. Yeah, Should I get the toe? Yes or no? Oh, I don't. Well, I don't know what's happening. I'm sorry. Stupid machine. There it goes. Thank yeah. You. Thank you. Have fun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We made it in. We made it in. We made it in. Oh, hello, Kelly. Okay, hello. hello. Okay guys, editing Jillian coming to you live real fast. I lost my glasses, so don't talk about these. I just need y'all to know that I was blackout drunk, I guess the moment I stepped foot into the venue. So I apologize for the rest of this video. I'm just gonna apologize on behalf of everything. My mask being off, like literally everything is so painful for me to watch right now because like I was not sober enough to put myself in check and I'm embarrassed beyond embarrassed so everything that you're about to comment negatively about this these next bits just know i'm already thinking about it big time big time enjoy blackout drunk jillian <laughs> i'm so sorry okay we're going up <laughs> don't expect a lot from the opener for me okay um i'm really drunk expect louie I love Sun New World, but expect Louie. Okay. Louie. Expect, yeah. Louie. Okay, like the main reason that my mask 
was taken off is because I was drinking still in the venue. I should not have been doing that. Like literally I should have known to just stop. I hadn't eaten all day and I think that just not eating and then all the drinks I had in the line and just everything like I should have stopped there. But I was like hitting my vape and drinking and so I don't think that I like could connect the fucking dots in my brain to put my goddamn mask back up. Like I was sober for Harry's show and all my videos never once did my mask came off, not even for pictures. Like I was a good child, I did good. So this one fucking, I'm just, I'm sorry. Don't think I'm an anti-masker because I genuinely am fucking not. Like, oh my God, I'm just like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I have failed you guys. I literally had like laid awake thinking about this last night. Okay, okay, back to the, back to it, back to it.
COVID got in the way out about two years ago. But the last time I did a tour show in... Uh... Do I ever lost you alone? You lost someone and it let you know. Everyone I work with, I talk about you lot. Anyone who works with me knows. All I ever fucking talk about is how amazing you are. And I, 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 honestly, this is not just some typical shit that people say on stage, because whatever. I mean, honestly, I feel... I need you, and you need me, and I fucking like that. Yeah. Anyway, enough of this selfish shit. Let's do uh, what we are. Have it.
made it through all of my concert videos and for someone who was drunk off their ass i can't believe i filmed the entire fucking thing is it good no are you gonna use it in your edits absolutely not <laughs> but here you go there's my concert footage i can't believe i filmed literally fucking everything i even like got in a fight with these girls 
during it and I filmed that as well. I filmed literally everything. To the security guard that had to put me in check, I'm sorry. Um, just sorry. Just sorry. But yeah, I can't believe I filmed literally fucking everything. I'm gonna hold her and you go for it, okay? Apparently I'm really drunk. I don't believe that, but... <laughs> Slowly, but we're almost at the hotel and then we'll be there. You're good. Give me like two Hey guys. Okay? You're good, okay? Yeah. She's staying yeah. at the canvas. We have one. We just checked out the hotel. Look at my fucking poster. This is so sad. Lily's about to drop me off at my car and I'm gonna go home. Are you ready to make your outro to the vlog? I'm ready. Well, with a heavy heart, it is time for us to part. That was, that was so sweet. <laughs> Look at you, like a poet. <laughs> I would have died without her by my side last night. I would have died. So, you've been a part of this vlog the majority of the entire way, and I will miss you very much. I'm gonna miss you too. Catch us in LA though. Ah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Bye, vlog, say goodbye to Lily. Bye. <laughs> well guys, I made it back to my car and I'm gonna go ahead and end off my Louis Tomlinson Dallas show. I'm excited to go back and watch all my videos so I can actually be like, oh yeah, I did see that. That did happen. Cause, oh my fucking God. Guys, I don't, I, I know that like I had that little video of me being drunk, but like I was, so I was sobbing about Harry and wanting him to like just be happy. And it was like, it was it was it was bad guys it was really fucking bad and then i was like running up and down the halls i was threatening to go on the roof i was like i'm leaving like oh uh, it was just really bad okay i had to be like held like lily said that she had to like hold on to me while i slept because she was like if you moved i was would, would wake up and be able to like tell you to get the fuck back in bed and so you couldn't leave and just a lot it was just a lot so but after last night i'm one billion percent gonna be in la so look out for the la vlog but yeah this was an experience for sure i'm happy that it happened and i can't wait to edit this little vlog and i hope you guys enjoyed it i need to shower brush my teeth i'm gonna go get a fucking sprite from waterburger and like zap myself back to life but look at my poster. This was $15 and it looks like I just like beat the shit out of it. Like this, like what the fuck? I'm so sad. Yeah, I got that, the black shirt and the gray shirt. So if you like see the merch, let me show you guys my merch real fast. I also kept the bag it came in. I don't know. And it's really soft. So it's got like the smiley, the smiley on it and then like and then like this is what the back of it looks like, you know. It's got like all the dates and stuff. So that's the gray shirt I got. And then the black shirt just says like a little world tour on it. And then here's the back of it. Yes. I will be getting the sweatshirt and a new poster when I go to LA. Can't wait for that, but yeah. Okay, I'm gonna head home. This was, I love, I love Louie. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And yeah, this was a quite an experience. Wish I didn't get that fucking drunk, but it's whatever. It happened and it's whatever. Anyways, bye. <laughs>